Well, if you could have any, any, any superpower, which one would you choose? If invisibility tops your list, good news. Science is apparently now a step closer to making invisibility possible. Michi Yukako is a theoretical physics professor and host of Sci-Fi Science, Physics of the Impossible, which is based on his best-selling book. All right, Michio. So they have managed now, scientists have managed to make something invisible? This is a game changer. We're talking about taking a small object, three dimensions, not two like before, shining infrared light on it and making it disappear just like that. This was once thought to be impossible, and now it's been done in the laboratory in Germany. How? How does this, I, I guess this relates to the way we see, the way we see that something is, is light being reflected off of objects? That's right. There's a new substance called metamaterials. If I'm wrapped in a metamaterial cylinder, for example, light would wrap around me and come out the other end. Anyone inside the cylinder is invisible as a consequence. So metamaterials allows you to control the direction of light, and you can make it bend into a pretzel if you feel like it. This is amazing. Once thought to be impossible, and now it's done in the laboratory. All right, they only did it on a little speck, like a bump that was on a piece of gold. That's right. But this could be expanded to, literally, to, I, I could put on a cloak and I would be invisible? You could be as, it could be as big as a jet plane. We're talking about taking a blanket, putting a blanket over a jet plane. Now, the minimum materials are very expensive. It, each one has to be custom made at the present time. How far away are we from actually, from, you know, you and I being able to walk around with an invisibility cloak? Well, it's not going to happen anytime soon. We're talking about years, maybe decades, to perfect it just like Harry Potter's cloak. However, the next step is to make it for visible light, not just infrared light. The next step beyond that is to scale it up to larger and larger objects. Michio Kaku, thank you so much. Mm -hmm. What do you think of that? Let, let's, see, let's see if Michio can make me disappear right now. One, two. <laughs> Incredible! <laughs> I'm still here. Now fix it.